Praise be to God. Daily one missionary biography. Today's missionary Benjamin Skulls, born in 1689, died in 1760. City Brandenburg, country Germany, mission area India. It was Grandler who worked very closely with Ziegenwald during his last days in his gospel ministry. Grandler prayed fervently asking God to provide people to faithfully carry out the duties of the church after his death. God answered his prayers by sending Benjamin Skulls along with his two other friends to Tranquebar. Encouraged by the arrival of new missionaries, Grandler finished all his duties and laid himself peacefully at the feet of the Lord. Benjamin Skulls was a missionary who was greatly motivated and interested in doing God's work. He once gathered all the missionaries who were working with them to strengthen their faith and help them understand and carry out the responsibilities laid before them. He was gifted with the ability to learn different languages with ease. He learned Tamil in order to preach in Tamil. He translated many hymns in German into Tamil. He also completed the translation work which was left unfinished by Ziegenwald. He traveled by foot to several villages and preached the love of God. He went to Karalore in 1726 after completing his 6 years of ministry at Tranquebar. Later, he also went to preach the gospel at places in and around Chennai. His missionary journey covered more than 100 villages. He started his school at George Town in Chennai. He used to connect closely with the people around him and preached about Jesus Christ to them. He also learned the language of Telugu and wrote many books in Telugu. He translated the New Testament and the book of Psalms into Hindustani. More than 700 people received baptism and accepted the Lord Jesus Christ as their savior because of his services. Beloved, what efforts do you make to preach Jesus Christ to others? God bless you.